Hi there, it's Gary Kent with Keller Williams, and there are six key things that you should know just after, I mean, you should know beforehand, but they're relevant just after you close in your new home. So those are in no particular order. Number one, change the locks on the home. Uh, you have no idea who has a key to the house, and you don't want to just use the old owner's key. There could be the neighbor that has a key, the real estate agent that has a key, friend that has a key, uh, daughter's boyfriend that has a key, so you want to avoid all that. Uh, the next thing is, it's a good idea to clean the carpets, um, unless the seller did that for you, because, you know, I won't get it, get into it, but just clean the carpets. Uh, next two things are find the water shut off and find the breaker box, because there are going to be times, hopefully not, but there could be a time when you need to shut the water off and you want to know where to do that and how to do that. And then with the breaker box, maybe you pop a breaker, there could be other reasons you want to know where the breaker box is. Uh, the next thing to know is your first payment is going to be due not the next first of the month, but the following first of the month. Now, if you close on the first, it could possibly be the coming first of the month. But assuming you close during the month, your first payment is almost never going to be due coming up on the first. It'll be so many days until the first and then another month. And then the last thing is... When you close escrow, you will not get the original of the deed. There are some people that say, hey, I bought the house, where's the deed? That will be mailed to you several weeks after closing. And even though you know you may want to hang on to it, the truth is these things are digitized in the paper deed. Are, it's really not that important, but if you just want to play it safe and you're worried about the, the grid going down and all the computers being hacked, then keep a copy of the deed. So those are the six things to know after you close on your new home. And speaking of that, if you are interested in buying a home or, hey, selling a home, please call me and we would love to help you. Uh, my phone number is 858-457-KENT and that's 858-457-5368. Uh, or you can email me and that's gary at garykent.com. We'd love to help you. All right. Thanks. Have a good one. Bye.